Hi, in this video we're going to be taking a look at how to play on acoustic guitar. The Queen song, Seaside Rendezvous, from the Night at the Opera album. Just completed a video of playing this one along with the record. So check that one out, uh, that video out in conjunction with this one. So this is kind of a breakdown of what's going on. Uh, now the introduction, uh, adapted for uh, acoustic guitar, is... That's the first part. Now you can see on the guitar tab, G string, open second, third, fourth, third high, uh, high A, back to that G note, fourth of uh, G, sixth of B, to the fifth of D, bring our uh, ring finger down to the fifth A, thumb on the third of bottom A for the G, so we've got that. That's, the, that's the, the first part of the introduction. We then have this where we play in the 6th of G, 8th of the D, and we're going back and forth. Then with double stops on all on the G and the B string, 10 frets, 9 and 8, 7 and 6, 5th frets, 4th and 3rd. We have that. Then on the third fret of bottom A to, end, uh, to go into the song. So we have this. Like that. To go into the song. So I've taken the chords for this from the Stephen Robertson Complete Queen Songbook. Now, if I've altered any, anything, is more to do with the fact that obviously the, the chords that are written out of this are because it's been played on piano. Sometimes adapting them for the guitar, sometimes it's a little bit difficult to finger everything because you are adapting it. So if I say G7 and it's a G7 slash B, I do apologise. So we're starting off with the C chord, and I'll attempt to sing it. C is We have this, which is on the D string, 5th to 6th to 7th, 6, 5, so 5, 6, 7, 6, 5. Then we're going to go to the G7, what do you feel inside? And then we're going to do a quick G, A minor, back to G, technically slash B, but I tend to go, because that's quite a handful and quite quick. Like that. So go. Wherever you stroll along with me. I don't even know what to play it. What I feel inside. Now go to D minor. Meanwhile, I ask you to. Now this is really quick. We've got that G, A minor, G7, slash B, A minor, G. And we're going to go. Now we're going to C. Well, if you can, but you C7 can. I. Now we're going to go to F. Love G. You. C. Mad. E minor. E. That's all quite quick. Love you. Kind of keeping the rhythm in there. And then on the lines. Let my imagination run away with you gladly. We've got this F, E minor, D minor, C. My, my imagination run away with you. G minor 7. My imagination run away with you. Like that. So then the next line is... So we've got C, Brand new. now a G augmented slash B, I'm just doing a G augmented, I'm doing the first, uh, sorry, the third fret of high E and the fourth frets of B and D, to keep it really simple. 
and then a G minor slash B flat I'm just purely doing again third frets of uh, the D the B and the high E when your ankle hailing A7 commendable and we've got this E, E flat, D, G, C and I want to do that in bar chords for simplicity so that first uh, line, uh, first verse is E aside whenever you stroll We then come to this next section, which is uh, fairly simple. I feel so F romantic. Can we do it again? Can we G minor? Do it again sometime. I'd like that to say. Fantastic sailing. I kind of say that French. Da 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 da. A to D. And at the B flat peak of the A7 season. The now on the Mediterranean, we've got this G sharp six to G seven. I'm just going to do a G sharp chord to G seven. So peak of the season at the Mediterranean. And then we've got this quick run. This time, of, so this time of year gets so fashionable. So all together, that should sound like this. I feel so romantic. We then come to um, the middle eights bit, which is quite quite funny instrumental little bit. So what I'm going to do for this is stick on C. Like what we did before. Da, da, da. Going to D minor. Then we have this C from C to C7. Obviously, the chords are written on the screen, and I'm going to go. So, do that again. Like that. We then have this. C to the G augmented a little bit that we did before we go and then we've got which is the E to E flat then G to C so that's the instrumental bit slowed down obviously more accurately played with uh, when I played along with the record itself the next line um, is again we're going to that F yeah, I feel like dancing in the rain. G minor, can I have a bottle of tea? Keep on say dancing. Could I hear the day? And then that B flat, dollar to A7, G sharp, G7, sorry. So, jollification as a matter of fact. What we did before. Now we're coming at the end of the song. C chord underneath the moon. Together we'll sail across the sea. G reminiscing every time. We're going from that G to an A, a minor to a G7 slash B. Reminiscing every time. D minor. Meanwhile, I ask you to. what we looked at before that G A minor G7 slash B A minor G 
going to see you see you have to tell your daddy if you can but you'll see seven valentino right upon an omnibus and in the casino that's chord progression that we came across before then right at the end we've got this get a new facial So again, that C to the G augmented G minor slash B. We looked at before, so that should sound like this. Get in the facial, start a sensation. See siren, the door open. See siren, the door open. So as always, thank you for watching. I hope that breaks it down a little bit. Check the video out if it's been played along with the record. Uh, and hopefully you'll be able to learn how to do that too. So as always, thank you for watching.